today, Brolga and fellow kangaroo mom Cynthia are on their way to collect five kangaroos that are ready for release into the wild. How we know that they're ready is one day we go into the enclosure and as long as all the kangaroos run away from us, the same people that raised them when they were orphans, we now see fear in them that they're seeing a person. That's when we know they're ready. We've got to now catch them, and that's the hard part. We go in with big nets, and it's a bit like catching a butterfly that weighs 20 kilos. Now this animal is like a wild kangaroo being chased by a predator. So they're going to try and run around you like someone playing football. She's coming back. She was coming back. <laughs> Here we go, three and one. All right, you push them down here, Cynthia. I'm a trying. I've got to be really careful, because that kangaroo can jump two metres high. It can almost take you with it. Oh, mate. Some of the roos are reluctant, but experts Brolga and Cynthia know exactly how to handle them safely. Settle down. Settle down. One down, four to go. Four to go. <laughs> I did it! I did it! I did it! <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> Cynthia's in her 70s. I mean, she's no spring chicken but she's got the dedication and the motivation and the will to keep going like someone my age. Good catch. Good catch. Life of the old girl yet. <laughs> and I must admit that I don't do too much. I might catch them now and again, but usually that's Brolga's job these days. But um, I enjoy it. I did it, I did it, I did it. <laughs> I guess I'll do it to the day I drop her. <laughs> Two <laughs> Oops, ouch! Thanks, get me. With five kangaroos carefully on board, Broga and Cynthia set out to release them. 